I've played Guild Wars 2 for over 20,000 hours, and I've learned a whole lot and collected just about everything in the game, so it's a perfect time to go round again. Join me in the adventures of my completely fresh account known only as the Microtransaction Enjoyer on the quest of obtaining and unlocking everything in the game, from legendary gear and mounts to living world story episodes, maps, and ultimate gem store quality of life, purely through efficient and somewhat sensible gameplay. No real money required. It is Aurora time. I'm going to stay tagged up, because why not? Let's go do some Aurora stuff. Oh, Jormax Fury? Yes, perfect. I've arrived at the exact right time. This is beautiful. Uh, so now, what we're going to be able to do... I'll actually make the mushroom thing as well, actually. Uh, I'll get that done. I need the Griffin. And then we're basically done with Bitterfrost Frontier Master. But here it is, the champion corrupted griffin. That is going to conclude Aurora. And wait, wow. Oh, I need to go do, yeah, I need to do the Drake on Siren's Landing. I'm nearly done, guys. This is insane. All I need is those jade cores after this and the uh, the Drake. And I win. I'm actually done. That's insane. We've done it very quickly. Oh, yeah, there it is. Corrupted griffin talon. Nice. Now, Bloodstone Fen. I need the Jade things. Is there a timer for this? I don't think there is. It just happens, doesn't it? Oh, oh, oh! It does just happen. Oh, no. I need to get my... No, 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 no. I need a build. Hang on. Let's go. All right, I'm going in the LFG. Uh, Jade Gaming. Right, that'll do. Onwards! Let's get in there. Champion Jade Bow. Here we go. There we go. I didn't get it. Unlucky. Imagine if I don't get it this entire run. Can you imagine if that happened? Can you imagine if that is the reality that we're going to be living in? You know, the funny thing is, is that that's very... That could easily be the reality we live in. Wait, this guy actually got it first try. That's insane. Well, to be fair, I guess they could have been trying for a couple of days now. This is the one where I will get the Jade Core. It will happen. Right? Here it is. Yes! There we go. Ten Jade Contracts down. And that is the Jade Core. On our second attempt of this event, we were able to get it. So that means that we are done with everything except the Drake. So just Siren's Landing is left over. And then we're actually completely done. Very exciting. Right, Siren's Landing. Let's do this. Okay, uh, I'm just going to camp here and wait for the Drake to appear, I guess. Wait, I'm at the correct shrine, right? Yeah, Melandru's Reliquary. Yeah, okay, we're good. And I just need to wait. Yeah, you can see all these players are waiting for it by the looks of this for the Drake to spawn. So, oh well, they've been here for a while, so it's probably pretty soon. Okay, Aurora, and then that's that. And yeah, there, there, there. Stupid Vision. I prefer Aurora to Vision a lot, actually. Um, some of this stuff is a bit... Ugh. Although, Vision is very quick, to be fair. I think I can do all of Vision in one day, right? Yeah, I can definitely do all of Vision in one day. So it's significantly shorter than Aurora. Yeah. Let, while we're here, let, is there anything that's going to take me a long time? Um, this is uh, this is obviously annoying. The bridges, the the dra This is annoying, but even that's doable in a day. Honestly, like it, it shouldn't be too much of a big deal. Ah, oh, defend the shrine from the putrid brood mother. Wow, incredible. And this is it. That actually marks the end. This is the end of the Aurora collection. The rest of it is just a bit of pressing F. We are now done with by far the biggest part of this. There it is. Siren's Landing Master. Everything now is going to be, you know, a one-off. But I have all the reward tracks done. We can complete this whenever we want, pretty much. But I am going to save it for the grand opening because that's fun. In my opinion. But there you have it. Job done. Aurora Awakening is, for all intents and purposes, complete. Uh, so now it's going to be Vision. Uh, we'll grind out Vision over the next 
bit of time, I guess. I should do Coalescence as well, to be fair, because some of Coalescence Part 2 needs you to have a collection before you kill certain bosses, so I should actually get that done as well. Oh, no. I'll do that at some point. I mean, Aurora 2 is very basic. It's just you have to go to all the mastery points. Right? That's gonna be, that's like a half an hour job, right? I might just go and camp some bridge events, to be honest. I, I know that's a meme, but I, I kind of want to just go camp some bridge events. Right, go on then. Let's see if we can... You know what? Let me actually... I'm going to list... You know what? Let's do this. I, I'm... You know what? Let's make that happen. Dragonfall. Uh, bridge farm. And we only do bridges. Ah, oh, here's one. Nice. I'm just going to straight say this, guys. Here we go. We're going to make this into a... Oh, hang on. Oh, dude, I can't change the size of it. Okay. Right, hang on. And then here we go. Bridge farm. And we're just going to do only bridge events here. And more importantly, stay together. We do bridges one by one. God damn it. We do them one at a time. Stay together. Share the events. There we are. Yeah, it's very important that what we do here uh, is go around as a group instead of basically competing with each other. Otherwise, it's going to take millions of years, which is not what we want. But the good news is, I think, I think I've done it, guys. I think we've actually made our way onto a bridge themed map oh yes oh this is huge this is the strat guys if you're trying to do this just make a bridge farm squad because it looks like a huge amount of people are in the same position that i'm in uh, i'm in the position of pure hell so yeah just make an lfg that says bridge farm and then wow look at this we are just crushing these bridges and look at all these bridges. 14 out of 25. I'm over halfway. This is easy. Alright, good. Done. Right, so this is actually going to be... This will be the final bridge. I'm not going to do one more. 18, though. That's not bad. I've got nine bridges done today. That's really not bad. I don't hate that. We can very easily finish the job here. I don't think I can even do an intro. We've just got to go. That's... I, 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 I can't talk. There's nothing I can say. We just have to go, and we've got to go right now. Um, I want to get. I wanted to get as much of the legendary stuff done as I possibly can uh, before 900 hours. I'm actually pretty sure I'm doomed now. And look, I admit this. I admit this, guys. I, I got distracted and played way too much World versus World. I think I've over grinded really hard as well. I mean, I, I have 75 of each fractal chest. Look at this. I have like nearly five stacks of these encryptions. So we've gone a little bit too hard here. I was kind of having fun. I was enjoying myself. I got a little carried away, guys. I admit that. Um, <laughs> And the same thing with the world versus world. I actually am up to uh, 291 rank, right? Uh, and I've got nearly every reward track done, ready for the grand opening. It's going to be a big stream today, so let's just get into it and get this done. I'm just going to go for it. We're just going to try and blast as many of these collections as we possibly can. Uh, so let's go ahead and just do it. I'm just going to go to Istan, and we're going to see what we can do here. Uh, I'm just going to go as fast as possible. Uh, I'm not sure if I have anywhere near enough time. Bear in mind, I still have to do a full... Um, Crystal Desert map completion uh, for the gift of Arid Mastery for Coalescence. I'll try and get some raids in as well today after we're done with these collections. I've got to do Wing 5, 6, and 7 uh, at some point. That might be a tomorrow thing, though. We'll see. Maybe we'll crack out Coalescence tomorrow, uh, but we'll see. Uh, let's just let's just go. And I guess the first thing we've got to do is I believe I need to actually just finish this heart, I think, um, because... I actually forgot about the time gate here, the vision stuff, and I believe the treatise on astro lamps. I have to complete the heart, don't I? Um, yeah, exactly, yeah. So basically, I have to do this heart. That's the first order of business, so let's get to that. And I'm actually going to track vision 2, visions of Istan. Um, some of this stuff is just RP. I need to configure my blish here as well, because we are going to be abusing the hell out of blish, uh, I think is what we want to do. Uh, so let's get rid of collectibles. Can we get... Where is Vision? That's the question. Um, is Vision here? That's actually very... Is it in general? Ah, yeah, here we go. So I just want collections, legendary trinkets. This is what I actually want. Um, for this... Wait, what is this uh, pink line? 
Uh, I don't know, uh, but we'll figure that out later, right? Okay, we have to. I think the way. I think the really good way to do this heart is just to run around and touch all the mirrors, pretty much, and just press F on these. So, I guess let's get to work on that. And once we complete this heart, then we can buy the treatise on astral alignments. Very exciting stuff. I'm going to try and do the grand opening as well, because uh, I need to free up my inventory space uh, just to honestly handle all the materials I'm going to need. So we'll try and do a pretty big opening. Easy. Heart complete. Very good. All right, and now I think we can just go in here, can't we? Yeah, we got what you got for sale, and you should ha wait. That should be the. Oh no, I think yeah, we have to we have to get in, don't we? Uh, yeah, I'd like to see the restricted archives. Let me in. And where is it? There is uh, there it is. The treatise on astral alignments. There we are, and we have to go ahead and give that back. Now there we are. We've been allowed in to the the archives. Let us experience this vision. Well, I think this is the sky scale thing, isn't it? You have to fly around with the sky scale. So bear in mind, you will need the sky scale uh, for vision. Bear that in mind. Okay. There we are. Uh, and it wants us to do this. Here we go. Oh, look, and Blish is giving us this little path. Of course, I think this path is a bit overkill, to be honest, because what you all you have to really do here is follow the volatile magic. Every little one of these orbs that you touch with the volatile magic, it will actually completely reset your energy, as you can see here, which means this isn't really going to be super difficult because you can basically fly infinitely, but it's kind of cool to see the, you know, the pink line weaving through the air, I guess. Okay, here we go. Well, this is pretty meaty, isn't it? Look how long this is. This is crazy. Wow, this is actually really a very long path. But you know what? That's okay. Here we go. Very, very nice. And there it is. Two out of seven done with vision. Very good. Yeah, we need like the Dolyak thing as well, but I don't know when that really spawns. I guess you just kind of have to AFK in the map and wait until it does. So you have to watch out for that, I guess. I think it just randomly starts, apparently. I mean, I, I might just hop back here and see when one is up, because they are marked on the uh, the map with the little coffin. Doesn't appear to be the case right now. So I think I'll just go ahead and move on uh, to the next map. It's probably what we want to do. I need to check for the Death Branded Shatterer, actually. Um, oh, yeah, that's coming up. I must go and grab that, because I need that for the Thunderhead Peaks one, of course, with our memory encapsulator. And we also need Thunderhead Keep, so we've got to get on those. We can get both of those in a row in the uh, next thing coming up. So I guess I'll go to Sandswept Isles for now, as we don't have the final component that we need here for vision. So let's get up, move on to part two. Uh, ooh, that reminds me. I need to go and get the Olmakan Bandolier from the bank, don't I? I do, because we need that, because we actually have to make ourselves, well, complete a collection for a 32-slot bag. It is a bit of busy work, but I think we'll be okay. I think we will survive. Let's see if we can make that happen. Uh, where is it? It's here somewhere. Okay, there it is. Simple Ulmacan Vandalier. Okay. Nice. Deposit those materials. I'm gonna... I need to get rid of this. Look, my inventory is literally just full of ascended rings. Like, this is completely unhinged. But you know what? Maybe that's good. Maybe that is good. All right, nice. There we are. We'll get that collection going very, very soon. I will go and do this little vision thing first. Hmm. You know what? I'm kind of... I Maybe this is insane copium, but I'm starting to believe. Like, these collections are going pretty fast. Like, that first one really did not take me that much time at all. There is a very slim chance that I can actually pull this off within 11 hours. It could happen. I kind of believe it. You know, the thing that... Do you know what's actually going to screw me? It's actually raids, because... I need to do another full clear of raids. Literally a full clear. I need 25 insights. Uh, and I also need... Um, what else do I need to do? I also need to uh, do like all the, the that stuff as well, right? I need to do it again. I need to finish off my raid clear this week and do it again next week. That's actually kind of a lot of time, right? But it's doable. It is actually possible, I believe. But we're just going to have to really go for it. We're going to have to go full efficiency mode. It's the only way. Man, Vision is way faster than Aurora. How about this? We're absolutely burning this right now. We are just blasting. Okay, so let's get this Olmacan Bandolier done. So let's see. Blish, carry me, please. Uh, this entire collection is literally running around pressing F. Um, that's that's it, uh, pretty much. It's just a little bit of the, the old F pressing here. Uh, nothing wrong with that. We love that. You know, we enjoy that too. Um, but... 
I do need to uh, get this done quickly. We're going to have to make this go a little bit faster. And honestly, it's actually good to do this type of thing in a group because what what your uh, what can happen in a group is that your friends can kind of let you know when an event is happening. You can kind of be helping each other out. This is definitely a really good activity. I actually did Jahai with a friend, actually. Um, we were both on the collection, a guy called Nitro, and we both did the collection. Honestly, it made it a lot easier because we were able to say, hey, come over here, idiot, right, when the event, when an appropriate event was up, uh, which obviously allowed us to basically kind of have eyes on more than one place at once, which is actually really useful for accelerating the, um, accelerating the collection. Okay, in we go. Let's get the songbook. Boom, love to see it. Nice, part one done. And we get the next thing. We actually get the 24 slot or something, don't we? Yeah, we get a 24 slot bag. I might end up using this on my bank character, I think. Is what we might do on the bank character. I don't really want to use it on any of my mains because I don't like the bags that have a function. I just like vanilla bags that don't do anything. Uh, but yeah, we might go ahead and use that just on the storage character. Could even use that to open all the loot, even. Okay, let's see. What do we want? What does it want us to do now? Yeah, we have to complete this heart, and then we're done. This is actually a very quick heart. I I'm not going to do it the intentional way, though. I'm going to do it the uh, the unintentional way. And by that, I mean I'm just going to go down and just beat up all the golems. Here we go. Nice. Ha ha! I will not engage with your actually quite cool minigame. I will disregard it and instead just kill everything. Okay. So now we're going to have to wait for that event. So I guess I'm probably just going to skip this for now and go on to the next map. But yeah, we're basically done with this, I think. Bounty, bounty, meta event. I think that's meta event again, actually. And that's also meta event. All three of them are meta event there. Um, exterminator, Emog the Soul Beast... Um, yeah, this is just bounties now, and none of the ones that I need are up. Oh, hang on. Oh, oh, hang on. It just spawned, actually. Looks like an old rock gazelle's gone mad. Don't know. These gazelles are nasty. There we are. Old stone hoof. Perfect. Let's get to that. Right, old stone hoof, you are officially down. Nice. Job done. Oh, daily bounty hunter as well. We're, we're getting it all done at the same time. Well, let's go and see if the other one spawns. <laughs> Mighty T-Bots were removed from the arena part of it. We put a lot of work into that minigame. That is true. They did. Oh, nice. Did it actually spawn? That's crazy. Iron Shell spawn. That's really lucky. Yeah, I will try and do the opening today. I'm going to do a bit of a bumper stream. I'm going to blast the collections, do the grand opening, and process a lot of my uh, materials. Um, and yeah, we'll, we'll go from there and see how long we go. Because this is going rather well, actually. The efficiency here is... Actually, I'm quite happy with my pace so far. Ooh, I need to go and do Death Brand and Shadow. I'm trying to actually be a little bit efficient here, guys. Man, I honestly feel bad for anyone who watches this on YouTube. This is going to be like the most anxiety, stress-inducing YouTube video ever. Seriously. Because I'm going to be like... All right. I'm like, no, we got to do this. we got to do that. we got to do this. we got to do that. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to keep track of all the meta events and stuff like that because we need to complete them as quick as we possibly can to make this happen, which is quite funny, actually. Okay, so let's get this done. Very nice. Very, very, very nice. Okay, so Santo Ars now is more or less completed. So let's go ahead and look at Corner. However, I think we're going to take a detour and do the Death Branded Shatterer right now. So I need to go and hop over and do that. Uh, Visions of Corner. Here we go. Oh, dude, what a depressing map, man. Like, when you go to corner, you just go, ooh, 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 ooh. Right, off the Jahai, and let's get this done. Yeah, oh, by the way, guys, did you know you could do that? Guys, you can rearrange your priority achievements. Did you guys know that? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> crazy, right? Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, crazy. And there we are, we got him. There it is. Visions, three out of seven. Nice. Okay, good. We have to do the Elegy Arm, which is a little bit painful. And you got to do the Joko's Deed thing, which is also very painful. Right, let's go check if the Imposter event is up. And actually, we'll go and have a look at quite a lot of things here. Ooh, all right, we did it. Gathering Storm pre-event is up. Okay, perfect. I need to go. Oh, I, I, I should go early. Come on. Let's go. Yes. Okay, the Rampaging Elementals, I'm tagging up. Let's get this going. Uh, season 4, Sandsword Isles, Storm Meta, uh, Meme Edition. 
Okay, let's roll. Here we go. Okay, we're still at eight, eight, nine hours, guys. And we're, I think we're about... I think we're actually... This is going to sound like coat, but I actually think we're nearly halfway done with the real meat of this vision collection, which is good. Uh, uh, well, actually, hmm, Jahai is probably going to take quite a long time to get this updated record on Joko's deeds. That's going to be a little pain. And we have to do the elegy uh, armor as well. Hmm... That's going to take a while. What is going to own me is <laughs> I'm going to get completely owned by all these achievements. Although, uh, how many achievements do I actually need to do? You get four for free with the Griffin. I know that because you can just do the Griffin challenges, um, which is really not that bad uh, whatsoever. But yeah, you have to do this, don't you? So how many do I need? Oh, dude, I need 15 more achievements. Oh, God, that's bad. That is really bad. I think some of these are quite easy, though. Yeah, we can do Hunted, I guess, and kill all the little elite ones. We can do the uh, the race. Uh, yeah, the rare enemies, we can do that. We can do the... Yeah, 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 yeah. The Branded Hydra. All the Griffin stuff is super easy, so we can do that. All right. That should do it. There we are. We now have the Smashed Vase. Or Vase, if that's your thing. Let's go get some Driftwood. Okay, now we have the 28 slots, so we're on to the final stage of the collection now. Okay, what comes next? And that is going to be the final part. So, Starcaller, Sen of the Desecrated, Specimen Chamber, uh, Depths of the Cave in Whispering Grottos of Elon Riverlands, defeat both bosses in the Specimen Chamber, and then bring Mom's Bow to Effie. Okay, well, let's go ahead and do that. Uh, I, think I, I think I've kind of messed up here. I'm pretty sure you need to do the pre-event here, don't you? And I, I haven't done the pre-event, so I think that's kind of what's going wrong here. Because I'm presuming that I might get credit for the boss kills, but I won't get credit uh, for actually completing the pre-event, which is gaining access to the specimen chamber. So we might have to do this again. That's fine, though. Oh, oh no, I'm missing Thunderhead Peak. I better go do that. Okay. Onwards. Ah, nice. Yeah, this is actually the good news about these maps not being super popular. Uh, is actually the following. It's that it's actually pretty easy to arrive late. Because the maps won't be full. Right, nice. Wrathbringer, done. Boom, there it is. So we're basically done with Thunderhead Peaks. Jahai, we just need to do the achievements. Ooh, the Corpse Caravan in Istan. Let me go check that out, see if one of those is up. Let's go check it out. Some more bridges? I mean, yeah, I might have to do that. Some bridges might have to be activated. <laughs> it's possible. It's definitely possible. It's not looking good, is it? Right, bridges. I actually will do the bridges. Let's just get it done. Let's just... Let's just get it over with. Two more. We just need two bridges. How hard can that possibly be? <laughs> nice! I can't believe yes, I'm done with the bridges, guys. I'm free. I'm free. I need to go and do... I'm going to go check... The, see if that corpse caravan is still... See if there is one up. I'm not going to continue doing this event. I don't really care about the, uh, the champions whatsoever. Okay, good. Right. I'm out. I'm going to make a new squad. I'll leave them to this. And we're going to go back over there. We're going... I'm going to go check Istan first. If I can get that corpse caravan, we're going to be having a good time. We're going to be full of joy and happiness. Let's see if we got one up. Any corpse caravans? Ah, oh, no. We're not looking good. No corpse caravans. Unlucky. How about Sandswept Isles Meta? How about that one? Let's see if we can get ourselves... Oh, there's no specimen chamber up. Maybe the, the event's happening, though. Oh, hang on. Look. Um... The, the, the seepage in the specimen chamber is depleting the laser array's primary power. Primary power source disrupted in three minutes. Is that good? I think that's what we need. That sounds like the event's about to start. Well, maybe it's about to throw us out. Who knows? Okay, good news, though. Olmakan Bandolier has been completed. Uh, I believe we need to go and actually buy this thing, don't we, now? We need to pay five gold to actually unlock this. But that's good. Yep, there we go. Vision of Equipment, Olmakan Bandolier. And that's six out of seven for Santa Ars. That's essentially done as we have everything else. I'll go back to Istan. Let's go check. 
So here we have the corpse caravan. I'm probably going to use it on my bank character just for 32 slots. But hey, 32 slot bank. Not too bad, is it? Quite nifty. Corpse caravan? No. Oh, I'll go actually quickly check uh, Thunderhead Peaks. Because we need that event. Then we're done entirely. It's nice to, it's just nice to kind of wrap things up, isn't it? Oh, is this the thing, actually? Defend the Zephyrites. Ooh. Is that it? I think it is. Is this the remainder of Wave 3? Is this it? Are we about to be a action of vision or a vision of action? Yes, apparently. Nice. I'm not equipping the 32 slot bag because it's one of the ones that annoys me. Um, the contents of the will not move when the inventory is sorted yet. I don't, I don't like that. That's going to annoy me. I can't handle it mentally. One of your first bags will never have to be sorted. That's not a bad idea, actually. That's huge. Because it will always have all of this unhinged. You know, honestly, I kind of like that idea. If I just replace this bag, then it doesn't matter, right? No, 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 that's cancer. I'm not doing it. Oh, man. I could really use it, though, couldn't I? I'm doing it. Oh, wait, no, I'm not doing it. It's made it worse. I'm, I'm going to put this one here. All right. Oh, oh, God, no, I hate it. No. Oh, this is terrible, guys. This is an absolute fucking disaster. Why did I do this? This is terrible. Oh, it's horrific. I can't do it. Give me the old bag back. Where's it gone? Okay, there it is. No, I, I can't do it, guys. Oh, no, it won't let me do it. Because the size is wrong. Oh my god. And look what's happened. Everything's scuffed now. Why Why did you guys tell me to do this? This is a terrible idea. I hate it. Oh my god. What trash. Oh, I, I don't think I can do this, actually. I can't do it. Um, I need to remove it. I need to swap it out somehow. Okay, there we go. Alright, we're free. We're free. We're free. Okay, there we go. Uh, I have to unequip it now. I've got to get rid of it. If I do this, it should be good. I wish you could, like, disable the uh, the effects here, right? And make it... No! How do I get rid of it? I can't get rid of it, guys. Oh, this is terrible. It's so much worse now. It's fine. We can put this up in the bank, I think. All right, okay, number one, let's get this done. I'm just going to pick the heavy every time. You need to pick the same weight here, by the way. Really funny. So make sure you do that. I'm going to do that by picking the top one, see? That's the big brain move. And there we go! Nice, that is a full set unlocked, I believe. And that means we need to go back to Dragonfall to purchase the thing now. Let's go. Uh, sell the junk. Oh, that's quite nice, isn't it? That's helped. That's helped out a fair bit. Dude, my inventory is now completely fucked. I can't sell this, but I can salvage them. Okay, go away. There must be a way to fix this. Look, all of my scrolls are in the wrong place now. This is, this is, this is a genuine nightmare, guys. What a nightmare. What a, what a, what a fucked up day, okay? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, why can't I swap it out? I can't. I I, I lose. It's over. Um. Oh, it's because I think I need an extra slot, right? Yes, I'm free. There we go. Okay, good. All right. So we're actually doing really well here. Six out of seven. Six out of seven. Six out of seven. Wait, what do I need on Istar? Oh yeah, I need the weapons. Yeah. Okay, we need the weapons. And the action. Dude, I need that goddamn corpse caravan, dude. It's not good. Okay, uh, let's go do corner. I'm just leaving Jahai to last because Jahai is just putrid. Oh, did this guy just finish the goddamn Choya? Oh! How does he do it? How does he do it? The Choya event just spawned. Turn me into a Choya. Let's do this. I'm in. Okay. Let's go. What do I have to do? I'm a Choya. Okay, Sway. Sway? Hell yeah. Okay. Oh, what's this one? Hop, hop. 
Okay, hop again. What's this one? Sway. Okay, we're nailing it. Sway. Clap. Clap. Wait, what even? No, I think that's raw, actually, isn't it? It's raw. We got it. Yes. Very nice. Oh, we got to do uh, spin. Wait, you guys are saying it's not when you're a choya? What are you guys talking about? This is hard bullshit. It's not doing anything, guys. What are you talking about? It's the event. You gotta complete the event. You gotta do the choya. Yeah. Dance on top of the stone? Wait. W wow. That is... That is unbelievably misleading. Wait, whoa, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. Wait, if you don't do the event... Wait, whoa, 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 hang on, hang on, hang on. Whoa, 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 whoa. Um, it wasn't you done for the chore too. I mean, I should still get credit. No, this is this is the wrong thing, guys. You, this is the achievement. No, you guys did not save me here. Uh, it it hasn't given me credit because you you it, it's that's not good enough. I'm a choya. I think the chat is in actually unhinged. Yeah, this is not the vision one, guys. You have to do the event. I think the chat is actually hard wrong. This is why I never trust the chat, dude. I'm a choya. Feels good. We're getting big progress here. Very big participation. Ooh, we gotta do clap, I think. We gotta sway. Choya is the new playable race, guys. And it feels good. We gotta roar, I think. We're kind of hitting this hard, though. The choir don't mess around, guys, when it comes to uh, dancing. Three, two, one. Boom. Visions of Corner. Nailed it. My inventory is ruined now because of that bag. Like, this is... What, what's happened to me, guys? It's over. Let's go do the Griffin stuff. That will keep me sane for a bit. So the real key with these Griffin adventures is knowing that if you um, press space while you're diving it gives you a lot of extra speed. Like that's the basically the key insight that you need to kind of understand here, right? Is that you can go a lot faster by doing this. And then this gives you enough speed to get these uh, Griffin things uh, completed. Oh, whoops, that is the wrong key. A little rusty, guys. Am I gonna make this? I might get wrecked here, to be honest, but let's see. I haven't done the path for a while. I don't really know the path. I'm, I admit it. Oh, whoops. Okay, let's go. Okay. Oh. There we are. Ooh. Where are we going now? Oh. Oh, there it is. Nice. That should do it. Boom! There we go. 27 seconds. And that's two achievements, guys. Very high value. And I'll definitely admit this, guys. This type of collection, this is the stuff that genuinely gives me trouble. Uh, I really don't like it. Um, just doing this just putrid, horrible busy work. It's everything I hate about gaming, you know? Like, it's the, it's the very worst thing in gaming. Really don't like it. But, we're here to be the Zero to Hero, guys. We have to get the legendaries. There's no way around it. There's no way around it. Okay, investigate the monument's destruction. Whoa. Cleaning up this filth is a public service. Eternal life, ha, serves them right. How could you? Eladar, why? Do you have something bad to do? Get lost. This is meant a lot to someone. Mind your own business. Who do you think you are? My second spear? Don't destroy anymore. Ooh. It's not looking good. It's not looking good. 
There we are. Memorial has been made. Right, there we are. No, I hit deposit. Ah! Ah! Okay. Okay. Uh, memorial among the worms and bones. Boom. Or a calcum ingots. Yeah. E yeah, yeah, we are eager, quick, and uncomplaining. That is us. Yeah, that's the definition of us, to be honest. We never complain. Right. Next. Caravan has spawned. Ooh. I am actually going to go and do that immediately. Um, let's get in there. Caravan! The corpse caravan has been found. Very good. Let's go. And there you have it. Beautiful. Vision of action. Domain of Istan is done. Okay, back to Achievement Fiesta. And there it is. Okay, good. Uh, so that's that, I guess. Good. Box of Elegy Armor. We'll just pick the heavy, I guess. And there it is. And now bear in mind, we actually have to buy those as well. You have to buy the thing from this vendor, I think, right? And it just costs you five gold again. We're burning through our gold today. There it is. Jahai. Ah, all right. Come on, then. Updated record of Joko's deeds. Let's do it. So, we need to complete an additional eight achievements. Now, there are some secret ones in here, and I think we should target those. Uh, let's... Let, well, we, we should be able to do Swan Dive, right? We're going to do that. I'm not doing the Hide and Seek. I, 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 I mentally can't handle it. Uh, we did Watchful Eyes. Let's get these fragments first. Let's go ahead and make this happen first. Boom. Okay, there we go. That's another achievement locked in. Now, so rare enemies. That seems like something that's pretty good. Oh, we could do the race as well. We need six more. I think we're actually doing okay here. I think I'm winning. I think we've done enough secret achievements that it, this is free. Oh, I'm kind of excited, guys. After we're done with this achievement, we're going straight into the grand opening. Like, the massive opening. Whoa! Oh, we have to land in that. There you are. I guess we could even do the story stuff. There's a few easy story achievements to do. Hunted. The branded Hydra. I mean, that should be pretty easy to do. I'm not doing the coins. I outright refuse. It's not going to happen. I reject it. It won't happen. At least five gifts. That should be easy, right? Okay. So that will be 35. Three more. And there it is. Oh. Yes. Crusty brand crystal from the Hydra as well. And there you go have it. All we gotta go do now is buy the thing from the Volatile Magic Vendor, and we're good to go. Oh, yes. Here we go. Updated record of Joko's deeds. And that's actually going to be our first vision thing, fully completed. Visions of Jahai. Everything else is six out of seven. Except this time we've got to wait for the time gate a little bit. But we can do that in a couple of days. But gamers. Gamers, gamers, gamers. It is actually the time that I guess you've probably all been waiting for. It is time for the grand opening.